Jujutsu Kaisen. Um, hey. This was my certified really good. Certified RGC. Certified RGC. Certified RGC. Certified RGC. Just off the bat there. Probably one of the best cover pages I've seen in a long time. <laughs> and I don't even I know. think undisputably top 10 in Petty. I don't even know what's happening. <laughs> Dude, do you understand what's happening here? Oh, not that one. <laughs> I oh. know what that one is. I thought the next page was yeah. what you're talking about, the two-page spread, where I'm like, what? Oh, that one's pretty cool. I, don't I like it a lot. Shot in the head back there. Yeah, I like it, it a lot, like but I'm also like, what's happening? It looks like it's him. Uh, like, you see the hair oh, on his head? Yeah, it's, shit. it's him getting shot and in the And then he has the mark on his... Okay. okay. This is a woo- That's just a weird one. <laughs> I like it. Interesting, interesting. It's well drawn. Or Shadowland, maybe. No. Um, last we left off, uh, Toto the goat showed up to save De- uh, Itadori. And is like, I can't fight anymore. But... um. You know, uh, Mahito's not waiting around for him to get his shit together. So, you know, he just charges forward. This guy claps his hands, switches places all over the place. A lot of, he kicks the flying fuck out of Mahito. Uh, it's really funny. Uh, and, you know, it's it's really just badass. But uh, he also gives this inspirational speech to Itadori. He's like, man, we're Jujutsu sorcerers. We It's not our job to, like you know, fucking figure out the logic of death to do that is to, is kind of a disservice to those who died. You know, it's what we got. to It's the thing we have to endure. So, you know, we got to do the thing. So he just fucks off, try goes off to fight Mahito. Meanwhile, this guy, the healer that, uh, uh, my came with, uh, Toto, uh, explains his curse of technique, which is essentially like, all right, so I didn't heal your wounds. I just stopped the bleeding essentially. So, they won't get any worse. They won't be bad at all, but they're not healed. You still have cuts and bruises, uh, and this won't do anything for any uh, damage you'll take down the line. But uh, I also did it on Kugisaki. Um, she's already dead, <laughs> but I did it anyway because the wounds are still fresh, and maybe I can make something out of nothing. But, um, you know the possibility of her dying is not zero. So, you know, keep keep your head up, kid. And I'm like, ooh. I think she's going to live, but only to say her last words, maybe. I don't know. Mm, I don't see... I, I hope not. I hope not either. But I I can't see it in any way. Um, I doubt if she does survive, I doubt she's going to be the same person that she was. Yeah. Um. Okay, so, you know, battle continues. It's cool. Um, Mahito's like, oh, I'm so excited to fight this guy. You know, I want to do it again. I want to make somebody feel really, really bad. And um, as he's about to go for another attack, Toto claps his hands and switches places with Itadori, who's in his pose. And then he just does his black flash punch, sends uh, Mahito flying. And he's like, I'll be sure to take on your share of the suffering. I almost ran away because of my sins. I'm back now. And uh, the chapter ends with the two boys just like right beside each other, like Ray, like squaring up. Toto's ripping off his shirt. Uh, it's uh, very cool. Um, yeah, Toto, uh, such a uh, cool character, man. Really, really dope. Part, one of the only times I, I, I'll agree and say that's cool. Ever. <laughs> what? Like, dude ripping off his shirt? I didn't yeah. mean that action. I meant just in general. This chapter is fucking fire. Oh, no. I, oh, okay. Well, I mean, I, I thought that panel was cool, too. I'm gonna... Yeah. Yeah. Um, That's the only time I'm gonna go. My so, um, how long before we before you wrap this up? Uh, man, this is good. Mm-hmm. I I had my doubts, but this is good. Is it weird to think that it's better that it's that I'm reading it spaced out than all through? It's interesting. I I wonder about that myself. Weird. I think it's better week to week because Jujutsu Kaisen can be a dense series, chapter by chapter. Like, yeah. there are chapters where it's literally, like, just explaining a lot of shit. Yes. So read With all that action, there is a lot of... Ex- yeah, yeah, well, we know. Not yeah. a bad thing, but it might be great week to week. I feel like it's probably the best week to week. I'm glad we mm-hmm. picked it up for that reason. Um, It's been a fun ride. I mean, I'll read by it. By the way. All the way through. Find out. By the way, the anime has been popping off for this show. Exciting. It's... 
yeah, it's so good. Like the animation is amazing, and I've been waiting. I've been meaning to check it out, honestly. Um, and yeah, like, wait till my hero game. Which pages are these? Pages eight and nine are reasons why I want to watch this fucking an- <laughs> this animated mm-hmm. because like reading this and and watching the panels and the way that he draws their movement, it's like you're literally watching the like like watching an anime. The way that they're moving and shit like you could see like they just have such like lively movement when all this is happening like on page eight oh no on page nine i think where like he switches places with the healer where he switches mahito's place with the healer and the way that he stumbles back and shit yeah you can feel the weight very accurate oh my god like i fucking love this shit bro like it just looks. I, I, don't, so I don't know cool. if there's a name for it, but it's the the dynamic. Mm-hmm. His 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 um yeah his dynamic drawing, like of emotion in scene is it, it, it's it's. It, I think it's, it's all beautiful. Right. I yeah. fucking love this art, it's, like the way that I, I almost said unparalleled, but I don't want to wild out and say something like that because I haven't read it all every manga. So I, I can't mean, read I think I think this it is there, in Shonen in Shonen Jump right now. I think this is the series that does it the best. Mm-hmm. For sure, without a doubt. I think, I think so. I did, I, is World Trigger in Shonen Jump? No. Okay, yeah. <laughs> but World Trigger, World Trigger is amazing in different aspects. Like when it comes to this style of art. That's why it's a much better movement. manga. Yeah. But I do <laughs> yeah. think it's still, I, I'll say this, I think World Trigger, when in its action scenes, it's just as good as this. Yeah, I agree. I think his. I just really like, I mean, that's just, I mean, that's one of the reasons I really like World Trigger in the first place anyway. So that's only saying an amazing thing, but I'm not, I just wanted to, yeah. I just wanted to be clear. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cause I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think it's surpassed World Trigger. It's great though. But no, I guess, man, I, I didn't even want to spend too much time on this one, but I, I really just want to comment on the fact, I, I really like Mahito. I like, I like his attitude and he's a really good villain because he's, 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 he's a much better version of Shigaraki. Ah, I said much it. Better. I said it. He is the character I wish Shigaraki was. That he's not, is a hot he's, take. He's evil for half. the sake of being evil. I, I we'll get we could get into it another time. When it, matter of fact, when Shigaraki comes back around, <laughs> right next chapter because they're gonna ignore Rock and stuff. Um, let me stop. Well, <laughs> I, I'll bring it up again because I don't say that lightly. Yeah, but um, because I do like Shigaraki also, but I also really dislike him in certain aspects of. Anyway, mm-hmm. I just, I mean, even his, his thought process, he's not stupid. He's really smart. So he's, he knows that he even, he's not mad cocky either. It's weird. Like he. Well, he's sure of himself. He's just a competitor, bro. Yeah. He's, he's just a very competitor. confident. He's, con- he's confident. And it's not mad dramatic why he wants to do the things he does. But, you know, that there is. There can be things that happen down the line where he develops into that and, and has more animosity towards certain things, you know? Well, his motivations more are tied naturally to... naturally than it happened with Shigaraki, in my opinion. His motivations are tied to the being he is. He's a curse, so... Being a curse, they're yeah. just a But it doesn't mean he can't curse. manifest into more. Sure, sure. Or, but that's... I feel like... Or, you know, more toxic. <laughs> I feel like you can't compare Shigaraki and, and, and Mahito, really, because it's like... It's like comparing a teenager to an adult you know like shigaraki doesn't have like mahito has it all figured out he knows who he is he knows everything about himself like he he that's why he's so sure about himself in these fights you know like shigaraki and deku still have shit to figure out and their their time's gonna come when they're gonna have their their shit in line and that's when their characters are gonna be fleshed out completely you know yeah i understand what you're saying um but even if, even if that is certainly the case with uh, Mahito, I still feel like, like as I read and I see what he's doing, I still look at him as a character. As man, I want to see you grow further. Where I don't feel that desire with Shigaraki, man. Why well, I do feel like, all right, I think we've seen, you know, well, who he is, man. Right. Like he, I, I get. We've had much more time with Shigaraki, and again, this is kind of like a hot new character too. You know what I mean on the block. Yeah. So it's. I, you know why I'm not. You know, I, I 
I ain't trying to disrespect Shigeru. No, it's fine. I get what you're saying because Mahito ha is shrouded in mystery. You know, we still don't know a lot about him, even with all the stuff that's that, that that's been shown about him. I think I know what so Josh is getting at. I guess it makes sense at. to have interest in him. What Josh is getting at is that I think, and it, it is just kind of like the point of Shigaraki, is that like Mahito is more like closer to uh, a very. He's a very um. Uh, progressive, not progressive, but um, uh, he's he's a guy who goes out and gets things. He has like a goal, you know. He's like mm. sure in himself. Where Shigaraki's the whole point of him is that he is developing alongside Deku, just like as a dark mirror. So Shigaraki is like learning like his motivations and why he does things. Whereas Mahito is very sure in what he is and why he exists, and that's why like it feels that I guess Mahito feels better is because he's more of a proactive that's what the word i was looking for it's more proactive villain there you go yeah than Shigaraki that makes sense is. his swag is is it's just he does like, have a lot of swag. swag too you know well, and we and gravitate like it's not different from shigaraki it's not i think it's mad od similar because shigaraki talks the same he and he's he's technical as well you know what i'm sure. saying he he speaks like oh i know I, I'm I'm not dumb. I know that y'all are trying. You know what I'm saying? It's literally the same kind of yeah. speech pattern and everything. It's just that. Well, that's what I'm saying is that I Mahito's think more interesting to me. Well, Mahito, just... yeah, Mahito's more proactive than Shigaraki, and that's why. And we gravitate towards those characters. It's that. It's yeah. it's that thing in in America where we you know we talked about like the positive arc and the negative arc and the flat character arc last week. Where if we see a more clear progression or a more like proactive in a char proactive nature in a character we gravitate towards that as opposed to somebody who's kind of figuring it out and not really growing or declining in a way or doing both at the same time because they're shigaraki is just trying to figure out his life essentially but mahito is very certain in who he is and what he does yeah you know the more the more josh talks about it the more i get interested in it because he is right like they are very similar characters yeah, and i feel like the mahito is like an like a grown-up version of uh of shigaraki in a way yeah that's how i feel too i feel like mahito is kind of like a fully realized shigaraki with someone who's who's got his shit figured out yeah i think i think you guys are pretty much on the money with that uh, as far as you know representing who Hito is I think kind of his role as a primary villain is which which I was kind of getting I guess confused in a dead end between Shigaraki and Itadori which is you know I, I look at the what's his name what's the main character's name in this fucking series Denji right Itadori. Denji no no Itadori, Itadori. 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 Chainsaw Man <laughs> shit yeah. you oh, said like three different Itadori. protagonists <laughs> yeah. Itadori he um He's been learning a lot about himself and life in general through Mahito as well. Mm -hmm. And one of the points of the manga that I think I was kind of close-minded to initially, but I'm starting to see maybe there's more of a picture here, is that they kind of, I think he represents the fact that, yeah, there is just bad stuff in this world, whether that's bad by your definition, bad by most people's definition, et cetera, et cetera. There are things out here that it's like, harmful to you there's things out here that's gonna not gonna make you feel good it's gonna make you bad there is negativity out in the world because you're a human and you can perceive things as negative mm -hmm. right and you can't always win you know you as far as saying oh i can figure this out and thing you know and and, and and correct this this situation sometimes these things just are you know fire is gonna burn right all right you don't want it to burn down your house you got to take that shit out yeah but, you know what I'm saying? He wanted to save Mahito. He thought he could talk to him. And now he's starting to realize, yeah, I got to kill him. Like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I got to kill this motherfucker. Your, your literal existence is is to just be pain. It ain't even like the Joker, bro. Mahito is just on another level. Yeah. But, um, all right. That's, this Jujutsu. is the most we've ever discussed with uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Probably not. Now, actually. But, <laughs> probably not, but I think like it's close. But in any case, that was Jujutsu Kaisen.